So the question shows us this statement. This is one great math challenge. Every minute, the first letter of each word is moved to the other end of the word. What this means, for example, if we look at this, all right, after one minute, the first letter, which is T, will move to the other end, so it will become H-I-S-T. And after another minute, H will move to the other end, so it will become like this. After another minute, it will become like this. And after the fourth minute, the same word, the original word, will appear again. Okay, Every arrow is one minute. So this will apply to all the words, and the question asks, in how many minutes will the original sentence appear back again? So we need all the words to appear back at the same time, to coincide at the same minute. So from here, let us just find out each word, how many minutes it takes for them to appear again. For this, it will take 4 minutes. For is, it will take 2 minutes. So the number of minutes it takes is the same as the number of letters it has. For 1, it will have 3 minutes. Great. And math will take five minutes, while well, challenge will take nine minutes. All right. So effectively, what we have to find is the lowest common multiple of all these numbers, because that is where both all of them will coincide again. So to find the LCM, which is the lowest common multiple of two, three, four, five, and nine. All right. So to do this. What we can do is find out what's the prime factors of all these numbers. 4 we know we can split up into 2 square or 2 times 2, while 9 can be split up into 3 square or 3 times 3. So from here we can see that the lowest common multiple will be the highest power of each prime factor. All right. So for 2 it will be 2 square, for 3 it will be 3 square. For 5, it will just be 5 power 1. Alright, so this is what our LCM will be, which is 4 multiplying by 9 multiplying by 5, giving us 180. Alright, so our LCM will be 180, which is also our answer, which will be 180 minutes.